Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Megan Prosser, and today is going to be a fun little interactive video for all of y'all if you want to pull out your hair right now. So if you guys are currently pulling out your hair right now, or if you just have really bad urges, you really want to pull, you're trying not to, either or, if you want to pull out your hair right now, this is the video for you because we're going to get interactive, we're going to get jiggy. But for real, let's start this. Hey, you. Yes, you. Hey. First things first, put down your hands. You do not need to do that. You don't need to pull out your hair. You're stronger than this silly disorder. You control your hands, not trigotillomania. You control your hands. So let's start off the video by putting them down. So first things first we're gonna do is we're gonna stand up. Wow. Stand up. Come on, guys. Up, 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 up. We're standing up, we're standing up, we're standing up. You're gonna stand up with me, and you're gonna walk around with me. <laughs> if you can't walk around with me, you're at work or something, you can't walk around, that's no problem. Don't walk around with me, but just listen to me. Just watch this video as a good distraction tool and just distract yourself from anything that's going on. But if you can walk around, walk around with me. And first things first we're doing is we're gonna go outside. So let's go outside. And look at this, we're in the beautiful outdoors. Here we are, y'all. So the reason why we came outside, right here, right now, is because if you remove yourself from the room or the situation that you were in where you wanted to pull out your hair, there's a really good chance that you won't wanna pull out your hair anymore because you left the room that was causing all the triggers. So first things first that I did was come outside because nature is beautiful, nature is wonderful. And honestly, it just helps to get some fresh air. Spending time with my plants. Next thing next, go talk to somebody. Let's go. Hi, Mom. You can do whatever you want. Yeah. But the windows have to stay. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. Okay. 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 So next thing next is to go talk to somebody. Go hang out with your family. We're watching some TV now. <laughs> oh, the door just opened. The front door. Teddy, no! Teddy, no! <laughs> so number three. Um, go chase your dog that just got out because you left the front door open when you went outside to um, get in tune with nature. I got my dog. What I was saying was, go hang out with your friends, go hang out with family, call a friend, call somebody. Actually, let's go call somebody right now. Let's go call a friend. Hold on one second. Okay, we're back upstairs. Time to call a friend. Hey, girl. What's up? You're frozen. I'm frozen? Oh, no, you're back. Okay. Okay, I'm filming a YouTube video right now. Um, would you care if I used this FaceTime call for it? Awesome. Hi! So this video is all about, um, like, watch this video if you want to pull out your hair. So one of the things that we're doing is FaceTiming a friend. Hello! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> hey girl. So, basically, yes, you guys should definitely FaceTime a friend. This is my wonderful friend, Kimberly. Kimmy! And she is like one of the best people ever. And if I ever wanted to pull out my hair, I could definitely go to Kimmy. And she would help me through it. And she would just be the best person ever. So. I love you, bitch! <laughs> I love you, girl! I love to curse. Oh my god. No, it's okay, you can curse. Okay. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> Thanks for being in my little segment of this video. No problem! FaceTime a friend! FaceTime a friend, bitches! FaceTime a friend! Woo! Okay, I love you so much. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Now here's your chance. Pause this video right now. If you still have the urge, if you're pulling out your hair, if you're struggling right now, stop this video right now and FaceTime somebody, call somebody, text somebody, contact someone. Or you can go do that super awkward thing where I sat with my mom on the couch and she was literally <laughs> so embarrassed. Go do one of those things. Go do something. So, um, another thing is to hang out with animals. Animals are such great emotional support for anything, honestly, not just for trichotillomania, but it also does help for a trick. If you have animals to care for, go take care of them. Let's go to my dogs. So, if you have dogs or cats, bring them outside. Play with them. Do something with the dogs. Do something with the cats. Do something with your birds. You know, whatever animal you have, hang out with them. They're the best. Come on, puppies. Let's run around. Yay, puppies. Run, 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 run. Yay. So 
So next thing for you creative guys, if you guys have time to do this, and this is something good if you're in the office and like I said, you couldn't get up and play with animals, go outside, get some fresh air, go speak to somebody. This might be something better for you office people who struggle in the office and if for some reason you're watching my video while you're in the office, this could help you. <laughs> is it drawing? Uh, uh, I am being extra right now. You can literally just do this with a pen and pencil, but I have some watercolors and paint. so. We're gonna do some painting today. If you guys haven't seen my last video, I posted my 1K giveaway. I'm 40 subscribers away from 1,000 subscribers. <gasps> what? So I'm giving away a sensory box. If you guys don't know what that is, go check out the video, go enter the giveaway, and I'm gonna add what I paint here into the giveaway. So like, pretty freaking cool. Pretty freaking cool. Hold on, I'm gonna go get normal paper because this is not working. Okay, I just tried painting on a canvas. It didn't work, so now we're just gonna do some normal paper. So I finished my painting. It says, keep your hands down. But of course you can just draw whatever you want and also you don't have to paint. But if you wanna paint, that's fun too. You can just doodle, obviously. Basically just do something with your hands is what I'm trying to get at. And again, I'm gonna be including this in the giveaway box that I'm doing, the little sensory box. So if you guys want this drawing that I just made right here, right now, go into that giveaway. But let's continue with the video. So next fun thing we can do um, is work out. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm gonna set up my camera for this, and I'm also not in workout attire, but let's go do some jumping jacks or something. Let's do this thing. What's up, you guys? Sorry this lighting is so horrible, but jumping jacks, let's do this. Yes. Get that workout in, girl. Jumping jacks, jumping jacks. And then maybe we can do some high knees. High knees, high knees, high knees. High knee? High knee. We can do some ab workouts. Let's do some abs. Some abs. We can do some crunches. Oh yeah. Crunch, crunch, crunch. But if you're not a working out type of gal or guy, um, let's move on to some jokes. So I'm one for classics, if you guys do not know that about me. I don't know why you guys would know that about me, but I'm one for classic jokes. I'm a good knock-knock type of gal. I think knock-knock jokes are so funny. So, let's read some knock knock jokes. Knock knock. Who's there? Cow says. Cow says who? No. A cow says moo. <laughs> knock knock. Who's there? A little old lady. A little old lady who? All this time. I had no idea that you could yodel. <laughs> knock knock. Who's there? Europe. Europe who? No, I'm not. <laughs> hey, I got one on you this time. Come on. Knock knock. Who's there? Etch. Etch who? Bless you. <laughs> so how's that for some crappy jokes? <laughs> God, those jokes were so bad. Okay, let me try to find like a good joke. Today at the bank, an old lady asked me to check her balance. So I pushed her over. <laughs> I bought some shoes from a drug dealer. I don't know what he laced them with, but I've been tripping all day. <laughs> I told my girlfriend she drew her eyebrows too high. She seemed surprised. <laughs> Why is Peter Pan always flying? He never lands. My boss told me to have a good day, so I went home. What do you call a guy with a rubber toe? Roberto. What did the pirate say when he turned 80? I am 80. <laughs> Get it? Like spent like spelt like A Y E M A T E Y. I maybe, but it's like also sounds like I'm 80. <laughs> totally just killed that one. <laughs> okay, but that's it for jokes. I hope this video helped you guys. I feel like this is turning into a long, messy video. So somebody actually suggested this video to me. It was a girl with the username Lindsay. I'm guessing her name is Lindsay. I think it is a girl. She asked me if I can make a video like this, and I think this is such a funny, like, good idea. It's not a funny idea, it's like a very, like, proactive idea, but I want to make a bunch of different versions of this. Like, this one was like, 
interactive. I just told you guys like different things to do and hopefully made you guys laugh or something. Um, but I want to do other versions, like maybe I want to do a more serious one where I'm like really talking you through an episode or something like that. But for today I wanted to test out something just a little bit more fun to do. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope it helped you stop pulling if you were pulling or if you wanted to pull. If you still want to pull, rewatch the video, do some different tips, or you know, do what helps you. You know yourself better than anybody else. I love you guys. I hope you guys have a great day. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.